My name is Raul Castañón. I am a senior analyst at 451 Research. We are a division of S&P Global Market Intelligence, and I cover enterprise communications and collaboration. PTT 2.0 is one of the categories in our market map for cloud communications and collaboration technologies. It is a technology that has the benefits of the traditional push to talk that was provided by wireless cellular providers, but with all the advanced benefits that cloud computing provides, such as end-to-end -end encryption, cloud managed connectivity over LTE and Wi-Fi. In other words, it's a modernized, up-to-date version of push to talk Voice automation is now very common for consumers. Think about voice-enabled devices such as smart speakers, which we but now commonly used to set our thermostat or handle our intelligent TV. Now in the enterprise, it is the use cases that are driving adoption of voice automation. If you think about the type of work that frontline workers do, there are many opportunities for voice automation. For example, healthcare like doctors and nurses, first responders like paramedics, medical technicians, firefighters, also factory line workers and drivers and food and grocery delivery workers. All of these have become essential workers during the pandemic. And given the nature of their work, which requires a hands-free heads up, meaning they have to be completely focused on their task, voice automation in the form of standard operating procedures makes a lot of sense for example, for preventive maintenance, security checklists, and other procedures. Access to knowledge bases has become very common for knowledge workers, but still a very big opportunity for frontline workers for different reasons. You have to think of frontline workers, which for the most part, directly engage with, with customers as the last mile for the delivery of goods and services. Therefore, agile delivery customer satisfaction depends on how they engage with customers. Then having the information at their fingertips in real time without having to leave the customer alone to check for inventory, order status updates, or talk to a subject matter expert can be very helpful. The real-time communications and collaboration proved their criticality during the COVID-19 pandemic, thinking about the delivery of goods and services during the lockdown period. Even more for the frontline workers who engage directly with customers. For many organizations, digital communications and frontline workers were the critical elements for business continuity during the lockdown period. Now, even as the lockdown measures are phased out, we have already seen irreversible changes in consumer behavior. According to our Voice of the Connected User Landscape, one out of two respondents are digital converts. This means consumers that tried new digital experiences for the first time during the COVID-19 quarantine and will continue their usage post-pandemic. This means that real-time communications for the frontline workforce will continue to be critical for operations in the post-pandemic era.